Hello again, I am Jim Bob, and welcome back to part two of our Days Gone playthrough. So we've got this uh, rebel camp here that's looking to pick us off. We're going to go in there and try and take them out first. Let's see. Can I headshot this guy with a crossbow? Yes, I can. There we go. <laughs> Gotta be wary of bullet drift or bullet drop. I said there are six of them. I'm only counting four more little markers. So there's someone out here that we don't know where they are. X to switch shoulders, wasn't it? There we go. So far, so good. Now, can I uh, retrieve the bolts? from the guys that I've shot in the head. I can use this. Uh, no, but I can get a sterilizer. There's still one more out here that I don't know about. Very nice. Two to find. One of them is marked, one of them isn't. This could be... Uh, this could be tricky. Where is this other person? I'm guessing somewhere over there with that one. Ah, there we go. That's a long distance. I don't know if I can get that one. Ooh, new gun. I'll take that. Yeah, I will take that. Thank you very much. Now it's a quick swap. Oh, um, there was something about how to change the special then. There we go, hold to get special. Which in this case is the crossbow. All right, there we go. That's the last of them. Must have followed us here. Sons of bitches. Stay the hell off O'Leary Mountain. Boozer, I found the camp. Just a few drifters looking to move in in our safe house. Like we were seeing before, it's time to start thinking about heading north. Let's get your arm fixed up and then worry about hitting the road. I'm going to be heading to my bike, deacon out. Alright, I think we've uh, tanked everything that we need to. Just gonna have a quick look back up here by the campfire though. Didn't check this out last time. 
Well, the campfire's gone out now, now that we've killed them. Interesting. This more than you. Take a new bat, I think. Could make something out of this. Yeah, I can always use this. All right, let's go find the bike. Ah, oh, damn freakers. Anymore. Yep, there's one over there as well. One over there, and one there. Lots of freakers. There's one there as well. <laughs> no easy way through, is there, by the look of it? I'm not seeing any more. Maybe we can go around them. Well, actually, let's try out, because we haven't tried it yet. Let's try... Distraction. Yeah. I don't think that worked. Oh, I see. I want to try and go around them if I can. I don't really want to get into a fight just yet. Bad weather can affect an enemy's ability to see and hear. Good to know. There's something up ahead of us. Oh Christ, look at that. Oh! Taking a little bit of a long route, but hopefully a safer route. Just see the one over by that car. Well, so it doesn't mean there aren't others. Yep, yeah, there's another one. And another one. Gotta get to my bike. Getting closer. Alright, let's try this distraction thing again.
That's not good. <laughs> this is nerve wracking. We know the boot knife works very, very quickly and efficiently in close combat, so. Oh, I don't like this at all. <laughs> So exposed. Oh wow, these things really do not like to go down, do they? Ah, oh, come on. Okay, uh, let's heal up. Yeah, uh, okay. Knife great against humans, not so good against freakers. <laughs> I missed the opportunity for a stealth kill as well, which is frustrating. Come on, baby, where the fuck are you? This is it. This is where we left it. Now, oh, has the bike been taken? The bike's gone. Yep. Fuck! Damn it, Copeland! Hey! You're from Copeland's camp? Bike! Hey, stop! Why, God damn it! I didn't take your bike, man. I swear. I'm not gonna kill you. Stop running. No, no, nothing. Hey! I bike. I didn't do nothing. Oh God damn it! All right now, I'm gonna kill you. Who's are you there? Get your bike. Nope. Copeland's men got to it before I did. I'm heading to his camp. Beacon out. Freakers nearby us as well. I wonder if we're going to be pulling them in towards the camp with us. not letting me mark them as enemies so I'm guessing they're not enemies at the moment St. John is that you? Some son of a bitch stole my bike! I know nothing about that. I gotta go talk to Van. <laughs> Hey, Manny. Hey, I haven't seen you in a while lately. You've been too busy to notice. Nose down. You work hard, they feed you. Yeah, camper's life. Yeah, camper's life. I read a book once. Zen and the Art of Bike Repair. You ever read it? No, I didn't have a lot of time for books back in the day. Yeah, I ran a shop. Farewell. Made all the grease monkeys read it. Being a mechanic requires great peace of mind, it said. 
Try working on an empty stomach. That'll focus your mind. Manny, I'm looking for a bike. Yeah? Oh. Oh, oh, oh. You don't want that one. Why not? It, it just came off the truck. I mean, some dumb son of a bitch left it out in the shit. Rusted up good. It rode hard, too. The fool the road it didn't know shit about bikes. <laughs> Is that right? Yeah, that's right. Shot the hell this one. I mean, we just partied it out. I mean, it didn't even have a fuel pump. We could have used oh, that. Man, fuel pump like this one? O okay. Like this one, Manny. Oh, okay, okay. See, now when I said fool, what I meant was the fools that brought that bike in. See, they didn't tie that shit down properly. So they left it like rattling around back there. Beak, and... Let's talk. Looks like you had some trouble. Got hit hard last night. Rippers again. Twice now they've been up here. Some say looking for you and Boozer. Out in the shit, folks say a lot of things. Folks around here take care of their own. Go enough days without food. Well, you see how it is. Lake not holding out? You get a fair amount of trout. Lake's fed by snowmelt. No one left to stock of fish. It's gonna run out sooner or later. Like everything else. We used to go hunting out here with the old man. We built deer blinds out here. Put down salt licks below us. Pick them off clean. Some winners had so much venison, we couldn't eat it all. I didn't think that was legal. Deer baiting, back in the day. My old man had only one law. The United States Constitution. He could only see us now. America. Land of the free. We are that. This is a pretty big sized camp, isn't it? Ah, so something for the touchpad. Swipe right or press R1 to view the map. Select from available objectives and track completed activities. Oh, I see. So we could just do this. But we do have the option of doing it with the touchpad. Interesting. He was bringing me something. Is that right? Folks here in a lot of pain, Deke. Oh, Leon. Doug said that he took off. No one's seen him. Mm. <laughs> Tell you what. You find his stash. You bring it to me. To me, Deke. You do that. Well... We'll see what we can do for you. The bike. That your men stole, that your men parted out. Salvage, Deke. Salvage. All right. Mm. I'll try to keep that in mind. By the way, nice hat. What? No, this one. Don't you ever die. Now, hold on. Leon wore a hat like this, didn't he? Go, I swear to God. Don't. You want to do business in my camp? You start doing some runs for me. Poop. Ah, shit. Okay. I'm here anyway. What do you got? Now that's more like it. A group of drifters has been harassing my supply runs. They've moved into the radio tower west of O'Leary Mountain. Isn't that your backyard? No, it's not, but uh, I'll take care of them. I thought you might. Alright, let's go back to Manny. Uh, where's the way down? So, do we get our bike back or... Are we going to have to build it back up bit from bit? Maybe we'll get a basic frame and just some basic parts. I don't know. Dick, Dick, hold up. I just want to say how sorry I am. I, I didn't know, I swear. 
Do you have any idea how much time I put into that bike? It was a drifter bike, Manny. I know, I know. I I'll make it up to you, I swear. I, I put together a new one. <laughs> you call this piece of shit a bike? I know, it's not... Look, I'll keep an eye out for, for more parts. I'll hook you up, I swear. Okay, what about my custom gas tank, Manny? You know, the one that I got for my dead wife. You gonna keep an eye out for that one, too? Jesus, Deke, I'm sorry. Just get the fuck out of my way. Yeah. What do you want? Well, there we go. There's our answer. We've been given a <laughs> uh, a rubbish bike that we get to upgrade through as we go through. I knew that bike upgrading was a big part of this, so... Me and Boozer can't ride north till I fix up this bike and get some better gear. Whatever you say, man. Hold on. Oh, yeah, that is uh, a very different bike, isn't it? New skill points. Okay. Uh, what do we want to go with? Range combat, survival, melee. Let's take a look at endurance skills. Increases the time the icons display in survival missions. Ah, there we go. Provides a chance to retrieve some bolts that you have fired from your crossbow. Definitely want that one. Nice. Crossbow bolts are automatically picked up when nearby. Hold L2 and tap R2 to use the crossbow. Alright, looks like we actually have the monkey wrench skill. I'm wondering if that again is a pre order bonus. Ooh, that's a good skill to have as well. Field repairs, we might take that one next. Uh, right. Manage, just let me look. When accelerating, tap circle to perform a drift. Helps us take corners quicker. We'll try that out in a moment, but I uh, wonder if this bike handles differently. Booster, you there? Yeah, Dick. Like I said, I'll be fine. Uh. I'm still going to head to that Nero checkpoint, find some uh, sterile bandages, uh, ointment, something. Yeah, sure, whatever. I'm going to go out, make sure the mountain's clear. Who's your... No, no, those are third degree burns. You stay there, you rest, okay? I'll, I'll be there as soon as I can. I guess... Um, I guess... Uh, you know, I could... I could use some for the pain. Yeah, yeah, I guess, I guess I'll see what I can find, I guess. This is it, the nearer checkpoint. I gotta find some shit for boozers, huh? Alright, how do I get off the bike? Ah, just press swear by the look of it.
This bike's almost complete. Uh, sorry, bike. This bass is almost completely destroyed. Luckily, ooh, they got something new. Uh, do I still have? No, I don't still have a muffler. All right. That'll work. <laughs> That's very, very, very nice indeed. Now, can I get the bolt back? Not from this one. All right. it is on the roof. If there was something inside, it would definitely know we're here. Generator. Got to be a generator here somewhere. Bingo. Here it is. You better start. I gotta find some gas. All right. Doesn't look to be anything collectible in here. Some kerosene, but we're full on kerosene. I wonder if crafting some Molotovs Allows us to collect. Yes, it does. Alright, so we're looking for red fuel canisters. I remember seeing fuel canisters when we fought. Oh, there's one. How do I collect that? Ah, there we go, just need to stand up. I'm also going to go and top our bike up as well because I noticed that that was less than 100% fuel when we first got on it. Uh, oh, we can quick save at the bike. Does not work in combat or on a mission. Makes sense. That should be it. Alright, so it's. Uh, Drop that there. So now let's get that generator started. That should power up the building and allow us to get some supplies. It's also probably going to get the freakers coming our way as well. Yes. Damn it. That's going to bring them all down on me. Yep. Speakers. Where the hell are the speakers? Sterile bandages, sterile bandages, where the hell would they keep this shit? Speaker on the roof. No, I can't leave without sterile bandages. I gotta keep switching the open after me. Shut the 
hell up. Ah, that's one way of doing it. I suppose I could have probably climbed up there. But at least we've got rid of the speakers. Turn my torch off as well now. Alright. Let's go back in and find what we need. You know, I'm gonna need the torch like I'm back on to get in here, aren't we? Yes, sterile bandages. Just what the doctor ordered. Now I just gotta get this back to Boozer. How hello. A Nero injector. Use them to permanently increase health, stamina, or focus. Oh, what's this? Nice. Nero tank. Some sort of a. What the hell? No. <laughs> Here goes nothing. Fill ammo at Copeland's camp, 21 cents. Or oh, is that just C21? I'm not quite sure. I'm not quite sure what the currency was there, if that was currency and how we paid for it, yeah, how we earned that currency. Unless it's just in camp credit or something. What else have we got? We have first aid kits. Right, now I saw a bed. Does that act like a, a health boost if we have a quick nap? Use a bunk at safe locations like bunkers or the safe house to sleep in advanced time. Some challenges like infestations can be approached differently depending on the time of day. Additionally, progress can be saved when near a bunk. We're just going to grab some shots. Right, so is it going to be daytime when we wake up? It is, and we got fresh freakers to deal with. Lovely. Ready to go back at it. <clears throat> Should have seen that one coming, really, shouldn't I? <laughs> oh, and there's a quick save option.
Alright, so they're out the front. I think if I go out this one, I should be okay. Question mark. For possible encounters or opportunities. Boozer, you there? Boozer, goddammit, answer me. <sighs> He's not picking up. Where the hell is he? <laughs> I enjoyed that. He's coming straight forward. Oh god, there's more of them. Dodge did not work there. <laughs> Unless I've forgotten what the dodge control is. Which is entirely possible. Ah, there we go. R1. I've been pressing circle. Oh, Savage. So we cleared out the last of those freakers there. More are coming. Let's get on the bike. Oh, what's this stuff? Anything? No. Oh, I wanted to see if I could find a muffler, didn't I? Not in there. Come on, big fella. Let me knock my bike over. <laughs> a rubbish bike compared to what it used to be. Uh, let's have a quick look, see if we can find a muffler. A silencer for our pistol. There we go. That's what I was looking for. Excellent stuff. Alright.
Oh no, wait, this is... This is our camp, isn't it? I just saw the smoke and I thought maybe, maybe it was uh, somewhere different. Alright, let's try and take the bike inside. Let's go find uh, Boozer, see if he's up here. Hey Boozer, I uh, found some shit for your arm. Boozer? Shit. Boozer! Hey! Oh, ah! Don't hurry! Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh shit! Oh, shit, Deke. Oh. Blown your goddamn head off. Look, uh, let me let me see that arm, huh? No, no, I got Come this. Come on, let me see that arm. Come on, all right. Just dig. Thanks, brother. Look, I'll, I'll be better, okay? We're gonna be fine. I mean, but obviously that's not going to happen. I mean, <laughs> he stayed behind when Boozer couldn't walk. It's not like he's going to get abandoned. Is that a storm rolling in? Sounds like it. He's still not wrapped his arm up, look. If I just get off the bike for a second, it says 70%. What is that? Let's see. That should do it. Aha, there we go. I see. Nice and simple. Yeah, here comes the rain. There's that storm that we've been hearing. One more thing. When they left, it appears they may have stolen some automatic rifles and a few shotguns. Watch yourself. Jesus, cold things. No! Apparently we have an opportunity somewhere over this way. I don't know what that opportunity is. I don't really want to go down there. To cut across. Oh! Ah, uh, what the... Oh, Jesus, ah. Uh, better have a look around, Deke. Oh, I see. So we we couldn't because we had to. We couldn't kill it.
Well, some poor sod got his face chewed off. Have to watch out for wolves. There's a bit of fuel up there. Can I climb up there? Doesn't seem to want to let me. Let's go around the side then. We shoot on sight. <laughs> Can't spell sight either. First sign of a post-apocalyptic world. Bad spelling everywhere. <laughs> that there. Time to go into stealth mode. Ooh, hello. Oh, I see. I can't carry multiple rifle weapons. One or the other. If I'd known that, I'd have stashed the hunting rifle. Back at the camp. Two bolts left, so I've got to be really careful about using my crossbow. What did you do? You shot up his generator, killed his radio uplift, didn't you? Oh, this isn't good. Something's out here. We need to start marking these guys as one there. Ah, one by the back door. Quietly does this. Yep, that'll do it. That's a pretty nice, hefty-looking melee weapon there. 
I like the look of that. Lawnmower machete. Where's the rest of them? There's a couple round here by the look of it. Or well, somebody round here. Uh, uh, oh, yep. There we go. We're almost halfway through the camp. I can see three more. Oh, there's another one. That's still one unaccounted for, I think. No, wait, we killed four. There's one, two, three, four marks. There's two still unaccounted for. I'm guessing there's somebody up there. At least one person up there. keep getting movement flashing over there. Is there someone inside that barrier? I could do with finding some more some more birch so I can make some more crossbow bolts I've got four people left to clear I only know where two of them are oh there we go there's another one and then one more after this uh, we are running out of time as well. We're going to call it an episode here. Uh, we will finish clearing this camp next time we come back. So that's it from me. Thanks for watching. I am Jim Bob, and I'll be back with some more Days Gone very soon.